All links and common questions related to this video will be in the video description. You can help support these video tutorials by rating the video or commenting. So you finally get the video you want, but you don't know how to open it. You just get git underscore video. The first thing I want you to do to be able to open it is right click the file, click rename, and we're going to add the file extension .flv to the end. Now we need an FLV player, a flash video player. So I'm just going to search Google for FLV player 1.3.3 and search for it and this is what it looks like. It's actually a really easy to use flash player and you can drag through and watch certain parts of the video it lets you change the audio too. So it's really simple to use you can just drag and drop the video into it too and it works. If you have Mac or Linux you can search uh, VLC player. VLC player is a free media player that works on multiple operating systems so just download it for your operating system and then you'll be able to use it with FLV files if you want to convert the FLV file into something you can put on your iPod or PSP or just something you can edit an AVI, a WMV or an MOV uh, you can use something called Media Coder it's a free program also just search for it on Google Media Coder go to download and just save it and uh, it's really, really easy to use. I'm just going to drag and drop git video.flv and it shows up on the list. Once you have that set, go to video, set the bitrate to around 300. If you want to put it on your iPod, you can set it as MP4, uh, 3GP for, what is it, PSP? I don't know. You can change the extension here. It has a little wizard that you can use that's really easy to use and it lets you select different formats to put it in. For the audio, uh, I select lame mp3. Uh, you can select sample rate as original and set it as 64 kilobits per second CBR, which is the easiest to edit. Once you finish setting it up, you can just click start and it'll start transcoding the video. If Media Coder didn't work for you for some reason or another, you can Google search uh, Super Converter super converter and uh, click it. It's also a very good video converter that's free. There's also WinAVI and RiverPass screen converter I think. I don't remember. There's a lot of video converters but I like Media Coder because it's free and it's pretty easy to use. You can see a full list of my videos by going to youtube.jimmyr.com. If you like my videos please subscribe. Anyways, thanks for listening.